Hello guys, and basically I'm going to show you how to take down Bradley with 40 grenades. And the path I'm tracing right now is the way which I'm going to follow to try and get this done. Basically from a naked to taking down Bradley. And the way I'm going to start is by hitting this barrel with the rock. And of course you're going to have to farm a lot of barrels to get enough scrap to buy all the grenades. I got a super lucky first crate, a pickaxe and a hazmat, which means not only can I break barrels in two hits, and then I've got a tool for it that won't break. I've also got a hazmat to withstand the radiation that launch is going to give off to me, so that's pretty much a big plus. And you can see I do actually break a ton of crates, all the way in the path that I trade you going from the snow down back to the bandit camp and all the way back to launch site. You can really see the path that I take, and I literally hit every single barrel that I see in the way there. And honestly, it's quite a bit. And even after breaking so many barrels, I don't. I barely even got enough crap. You can see by now, I've already got a full inventory of components and everything, and it's quite a bit. Now, I also got a crossbow from a crate, which it's pretty good, although it's not useful for this run. You know, I'll take what I can get. I can break barrels with it too, I guess. But yeah, I'm running the bandit camp right now, and you'll see what I'm doing. I'm checking all my stuff in the recycler, trying to get as much scrap as possible. You know, you just need like quite a damn lot of scrap because for 10 nades it's 80, which means that if you do want to get 40, it's going to be a lot of scrap. So 45 is the amount you really do want to get because 40 is the exact amount that you miss one and then what are you going to do from there? Just rocket to the button? It's really not going to work unless you do hit all of the nades and you should bring 5 for spare, so just bring 45. And you can see I put some extra stuff in the recycler while I go over here and buy more nades. Now do not do this if there's actually people online, but you can do it if there's nobody online, I guess, I don't know, wouldn't recommend it, I'm just trying to speedrun it. You can see I buy 40 nades and I can only afford free spares and I don't really think that's a good idea, so I do run back and I do get some more scrap from when I was recycling some random stuff. I get 20 extra, and I'm going to use that to buy a couple more nades, 3 more exactly, so I'm going to have a total of 46. And you'll notice something, when you buy nades, they come in stacks of 10, but like, you know how you can get like stacks of wood over 1000, you can also get stacks of grenades over 5, and the actual limit is 5, and you can see later I do end up splitting them up in my inventory as I try to move them around. Probably wasn't the best idea, but you know, it's a mistake and I'm a bit of an OCD freak, I gotta, if some of them are split up, I gotta fix all of them. But yeah, I do come at night time because that's how long it took me to actually get this far. I think I was about 15 minutes in, and you'll see, Bradley does shoot at me quite a bit and damage me a bit, and I'm really not in the best spot, so... I really do have to move my position and I end up running around the opposite way, running up the crate and I can get on the roof up here. And now I can shoot at Bradley. You will see that that was enough because he just came around the wrong side and ended up killing me as I but I did get one shot off I guess, so not bad. And I do spawn back and I have to run all the way back. I get my body right. And I in the perfect spot which, you know, I miss a mage. It's in the perfect spot where I can pretty much hit every mage and after I throw all the mages there's only one left. It actually does explode. And you can see I've taken down Bradley successfully, naked to Bradley in pretty much 20 minutes I guess. If you don't count me dying, which did take ages to get back because I spawned at the very top of the map when launch sites near the bottom. I don't know why it is daytime. But yeah, you can see what I get from the crates, it's actually quite insane. I run around and I get, I think my first crate, I get an armor door and a security camera which can give me a bit of scrap and I guess it's good for my first face since I just start off naked, but I do get an M2 and I do get 10 tech trash in a computer and I do get another computer in 10 tech trash which is quite good, especially the first, like for the start of the run. Having an M2, 20 tech trash, a bunch of scrap, that's pretty insane, so yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, like a comment if you really liked it, you know, 
comment if you actually did it in your wipe because I reckon you could do it in your actual wipe. And yeah, it'd be a lot of fun. So yeah, like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.